Hi guys, this episode will be days 21 to 30. If you haven't seen part one, I'll link it in the top right of the screen now. But first, we just hit 1700 subscribers. I just want to thank you guys so much. Now, my next goal is 2000. And if you want to help the channel out, go down and subscribe now. Now let's get on with the video. Flying through them. We've, uh, yeah, we got a few bits to do. We still need a how to use a generator and find a fuel station. So that is our mission for today. We're gonna head out and do a bit more exploring. Maybe in the vehicle, we'll see. Oh wow, we got a lot of Zeds that have come over. Oh yeah, that was a lot of Zeds actually. <laughs> oh, we found a gun store, that's good. That is good. Looks like we can get in through the back there, which is quite handy. Let's assess the situation first. So we don't just wanna go barreling in there. Um, not at all. All right, we got in the gun store. Let's have a, let's deal with these. All right, we have looted the gun store. We've got a lot of loot. We got a nice 45 suppressor, which is amazing. But we've also got a spas as well, uh, and a load of shotgun shells. So that is our aiming um, sorted. We can level that up fairly uh, quickly. We're going to be able to level that up uh, nice and easily, but of course. I don't really want to be blasting shotguns in uh, Raven Creek. It's it's, it's risky. Mm, got the tool store there. Don't really want to go in there yet. All right, I think we can get out of here for the th today. We've had a good haul. We've got a load of guns. We've got to get it all back in the base. So I think we'll head back now. All right, so we are home. I've unloaded everything. The base is once again quite a mess. So we're going to do a bit of a bit of sorting tomorrow, and maybe if we've got time, um, maybe look at. Uh, up in our aiming skill with a shotgun possibly we'll see how uh, see how we get on we're just going to kick around base for the rest of the day i think all right it's 20 to 11 and it's time for bed for old gil sparkman what a guy what a guy see you in the morning and the power is gone we've woken up to a power cut which uh, is an ideal but well it can't be helped really we need to how to find a generator and a fuel station but first we're gonna do a bit of sort sorting around base i want to put some crates together uh for some guns uh and we're gonna look at up in our aim skill as well today i think yeah i think we're gonna do it. we're gonna go out on foot and uh yeah try and uh blow some zombies away all right so we got a shotgun ready um it's 10 past uh, half past nine in the morning we're gonna go out and uh well, I'll do some shotgun fun. I don't know how this is going to turn out. Maybe not the best, but uh, we better also eat this stuff before it goes off as well. That's not rotten, is it? Uh, no, it's just stale. Okay. Uh, don't mind me. Just walking with a generator. I'll actually drop it here. We won't keep it in the car just yet. Let's go and do some uh, some gunning, shall we? Oh, we got some candidates down here. Let's go, baby. Oh, that's brought a load over. That has brought a load over. Don't know how smart of an idea this was, blasting a shotgun in uh, Raven Creek as we have, uh, yeah, got a lot of Zeds coming in. All right, let's get upstairs. Because we can actually go and stand on the roof here. That might be a good idea. Let's, uh... Ah, oh, there goes our rope. That's fine, no, that's fine. We may be staying around base today. <laughs> mm, they can't get up, but that's not ideal. Oh my god, I thought they were getting up then. Jesus Christ. So we have got a Remington. Um, now we have got Lead of the Dead on. So if we stand still, we do get an aim bonus. Um, so that's why I've decided to come out and use this against these bastards over here. But it won't. And there's no range on it, apparently, which is uh, amazing. <laughs> why can I not shoot out here? This is this is not good. Hmm. And a bit of a uh, bit of a predicament now, I think. Mm, looks fairly clear, just the ones inside the building, which we can probably deal with. Yeah, it does look fairly clear down there, but again, if they get the rope, we're not going to have anywhere to go. Well, at least we know the base defences work. <laughs> Aiming up, nice. Oh, Jesus Christ. Up we go. Hmm. We're going to just have to hang around base for the day, I think, and hopefully they'll uh, disperse if we don't cause too much noise. All right, it's the end of day 22. We're going to get some sleep and assess the situation tomorrow. This is such a bad idea, but well, at least it's, uh, you know, it keeps things interesting, doesn't it? Well, I'll uh, see you in the morning.
All right, we are on day 23. We are in a bit of a uh, bit of a situation, but uh, well, hopefully we'll uh, figure something out. Let's go and see what it's like. I can turn our torch on. Uh, let's see if we can see what it's like on the streaks. We may just have to try and get down. All right, well, wish me luck. Seems okay, to be honest. Oh, this fog is not nice. Uh, I've grabbed a load of clothes off of these dead Zeds, and I'm gonna rip it and put it up here. I've started doing it with a little, uh, with some stuff already, um, just in case we get ourselves in that situation again, which was not ideal. Jesus, it is really foggy. Yeah, we ain't going far today, no way. Yeah, let's get back in base for today. We're not, we're not going out in this. We've cleared the area, which is good. So we'll go sit on the roof, I think, and read something. Let's go and re-farm, and then actually, we can uh, have a look at our crops. I don't think they're going to be anywhere near ready, but we can at least go and have a look at them, can't we? Well, the fog has gone, so we are going to try and get down, just to clear out around the base after all of that. Looks okay out here. It looks like most of them come, have come to our base, which is quite good, actually, because it's cleared out the area by the looks of it. Yeah, we started to get tired, so we're going to head back, I think. I mean, we was up at, I think, half past four from the zombies banging. Oh, I haven't read that. Raven's Notes. Uh, from the zombies banging on the bloody um, doors, so. Well, it's 10 to 11 on the den end of day 23 in our dark little uh, apartment. It's very messy. Uh, we're going to have to sort it out because it is uh, quite annoying me. The, the, the mess everywhere. Um, so maybe we'll do that tomorrow. We'll, we'll see what the weather's like. But for now, we're off to bed and we will see you in the morning. All right, day 24, we are, we're gonna head out. We're gonna head out. I need to find a how to use a generator and a petrol station. Where the hell are all the petrol stations? Let's have a quick look at the map. Well, petrol stations I would have thought would be the black, little black buildings. Um, hmm. Maybe we go and have a look at that. Maybe. I know a way to check actually. We've got the whole map revealed, haven't we? So we can just uh, have a look down, uh, down by here. Oh, so it's a blue, I oh, know it's a green one. It's green, okay. Okay, so we're looking for green, uh, which could be any of these. Uh, maybe down here. Maybe that's one that looks like it could be a gas station. We'll go back down to the school today. We'll take the car. You never know. We might find a bookstore down there as well. We'll put the generator in the back as well, actually, just in case. There's a zippy market there. Let's let's go on foot and walk round. I think and. We might find one. We might get lucky and find one in the uh, in the magazine racks there. I don't know what this building is. Oh, we got some good trousers. Nomad trousers. Let's pop them on. Oh, and a Nomad Parker actually gives us better uh, better bite defense. But what does it replace? Oh, a leather jacket. And it's going to keep us warm. So we'll we'll see about that. We may not have. Uh, we may not be able to wear that because um, it may make us too hot. But we'll see. We'll see. Oh shit! An alarm. We gotta go. We gotta go. No, we ain't hanging around. Oh, we made it back. We made it back to G. Let's get the hell out of here. Let's go. I'm not hanging around with an alarm going off. Did manage to get a uh, can of fuel though from uh, one of the cars in the car park. All right, we've done some work on our new uh, on our new drip. We're looking good. We're looking good. We're probably gonna go upstairs and do a bit of reading of this magazine. What does this let me do? Scrap spear. Uh, I mean, it's probably not gonna be any use to us, but um, we may as well read it anyway. All right, it is ten to eleven. We've tidied the base up. You can't really see, but we've tidied it up a bit. It's looking a lot nicer. We're gonna hit the hay, um, and then tomorrow um, is uh, yeah, then another day down. Okay, day 25. We are, well, we're a quarter of the way through. It's looking good so far. We're struggling on a few things, but, um, you know, we're, we, we could be in a worse uh, position. Let's see these uh, refried, bre blah, 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 refried beans. Uh, and then I think we're going to head uh, north east out west, I think, today. That's, uh, and look for a bookstore over there, because I think east after that alarm is uh, a little bit too dangerous uh, for me at the minute, just till they disperse. We will take the motor as well, because why the hell not? Who knows what we might find. You know what, actually, maybe we look at getting in this uh, VHS store, because uh, more uh, a mechanic skill would be nice, actually. Because uh, then we can look at you know, really keeping our vehicle in good condition, as I don't really know how good a condition... I mean, it's in pretty good condition, but, you know, it's nice to be able to keep it... Um, going for a longer. 
I'm sure this big old coat we've got on is uh, affecting our swing speed. Combat mod speed modifier. Yeah, it is. Okay, we mightn't have to look at taking that off then. I mean, we don't have anything on our arms at the minute, which probably isn't the safest idea, but... Let's put it back on for now, um, just because it is a bit risky. That could save our life. But we'll probably go back to the uh, Wild Raccoon's jacket. Oh, wow. There is a lot of them in here, isn't there? All right, well, that's them cleared out. Now, let's go looking for uh, VHSs. Although, the power is out, so we can't actually watch them, I've just realised. But at least if we've got them, then we've got them. Okay, so we found Car Zone 2 and Car Zone 3, which is uh, really good. I can hear some banging. Um, that's really good. They're the two that were missing, so that's amazing. Now we just need to, uh, well, yeah, get get power. <laughs> okay, we found a nice little garden, but it doesn't really help us when it comes to, uh, well, the things we really need. Um, okay, wow. Yeah, let's, uh, this is not nice to drive through. Let's, uh, we're going to get out. We got a bail, we got a bail. Ah, oh, shit. Ah, damn it. Okay, this ain't good. Well, all, look at them all coming from everywhere. Wow, well, they actually pushed me all the way back to my base, which uh, is not ideal, but we should be able to get, hopefully, go back up and retrieve our car. Okay, looks like we've cleared it. Um, which is good and we might be able to get our car out of this jam. Well, we're out um, Luckily, we're gonna leave the car here um, For obvious reasons and, and go on foot. We're probably not gonna be able to get much done much else done today As it is 20 past 2. We probably will get tired soon, but Well, it's something I suppose. We will have to come and clear these roads probably <gasps> I see a bookstore. I see a bookstore. Oh, there's a lot in there. Look at that. Might not get at a gun store today. Oh, we are got we are tired, so yeah, we're probably not gonna get in there today. Yep, we're going. See ya! Let's get out of here. We know there's one there. Look at all of these, my god. Alright, this is a haul of uh, VHSs. We got a hell of a lot, but as I say, it's not really much good at the uh, at the minute. We will find a how to use a generator. I promise you that. Crops are coming on nicely on the roof. Very nicely indeed. We're, uh, I'm happy with that. I'm happy. All right, it is 10 past, uh, sorry, 20 past 10 on day 25 in the evening. And we're about to go to bed. And tomorrow will be day 26. We'll see you then. All right, we're on day 26. We are looking good. It's 20 to 9 in the morning. Today, we're going to try and push back up to the uh, to the bookstore and hopefully find out how to use generators. And I think I know where there may be a um, petrol station, a gas station. Hopefully, we shall see. We shall see. But, uh, yeah, we'll crack right on today. Uh, I think we're going to go on foot today just to be, uh, just to be safe. Oh, wow, they've broken through. Okay, let's go. Mm, there's a few of them up here, but uh, short work for our uh, for old Gil Sparkman now that he's become such a uh, such a warrior. Oh yeah, look at all them books! Wow, and there is no how to use generators. Wow. Okay. Brilliant. Um. Well, there we go. I really uh, don't know where else to look. Uh, we got a little mini mall down here, actually. Maybe this has got a, uh, a bookstore, possibly. All right, here we may as well have a look. Oh yeah, she's in good condition. We're having her. Oh yeah, boy. Here we go. Well, we got the Humvee back, which was pretty good. It's a nice, nice old weapon. We're probably just going to stay around because we're going to start getting tired soon, I think. So. We're probably just going to stay around the base. Let's go and have a quick look in these these buildings over here. See if there's any um, bookshelves or anything. Well, nothing in them buildings. A uh, bit of soap, but that was uh, literally it. So we're going to head back for the day, I think, now. All right, it is 10 to 11, and it is time for bed. And tomorrow we're going to try and see if we can find the gas station. So hopefully, uh, 
Hopefully we can, and hopefully there'll be a Hattie's generators in there. Um, but <laughs> we'll see. But uh, we'll see you in the morning. All right, day 27, 7 a.m. It's raining outside. It's uh, a little bit miserable. We're going to fill up, and we're going to just head straight down. I was like, oh, I think our water... Oh, no, water can't be running out. That's fine. So I believe there's a fuel station around here somewhere. Maybe that place there. So that's where we're going to head. We need to get to the school, and then... Probably go on foot, to be honest. We'll take the pickup because it's got the generator already in the back there. So, happy days. Oh, there's a pawn shop there. That's pretty good, actually. We're going to leave it for now. We know it's there. I want to find this bloody gas station. Oh, I found it. It's there. Let's go and clear the area. Oh, wow. There, there was a lot in there. Okay, good job we uh, we come down on foot. Look at him. Oh, it's another bunny pie. Not this time. Oh, Jesus. There is a lot. Oh, long blunt up one as well. Get in. So that's cleared. The good old mace. Trusty mace. Tin can mace. Club. Whatever. Uh, it's Kapul for us again. Oh, there's a gun store down there by the looks of it. No! No, there's no how to use a generator. Ah, no. Ah. Well, okay. Well, <laughs> at least we've uh, at least we've got a uh, a gas station. All right, we dropped the uh, the generator off, which is good, very good indeed. Um, let's now let's let's go to the pawn shop. Let's see what we can get out of there, and then head back. I think. All right, we are in the uh, in the pawn shop. There's uh, a few bits and bobs here. Nothing amazing, to be honest. Uh, we'll take the ammo. Oh, we got a machete, though. Oh, and a bill hook. Oh, and another machete. Yes, please. All right, well, we got a few bits from in here. Nothing, uh, nothing amazing, but yeah, it's uh, well, we got a few machetes, so it's pretty good, to be honest with you. Oh wow, we found something. Uh, which could actually be night vision goggles. So that would be pretty, uh, pretty good. We won't need a bloody uh, pa uh, power around our base if that works. Let's get home, I think. This actually protects us from bullets. Not that we really... Uh... Oh, look at the weather. Yeah, let's get the hell out of here. Well, here we are on our roof, back at base. The uh, crops are coming on nicely. I'm going to chest this helmet out. Oh, wow. We can... Wow, we can wear it with our welded mask. Does it have the, the night vision though? Oh yeah. Hmm. For some reason, uh, it will not let me uh, turn this on. I feel I have to need to put a battery in it, but I don't don't quite know how, to be honest. Oh well, we got a nice new helmet anyway, so that's that's all good. Let's get inside. I mean, we do have a lot of machetes now, so maybe we uh, we use uh, we do a bit of machete in. I think. All right, so it's ten to eleven. Uh, we're going to hit the hay, and tomorrow we're going to, well, search around for some how to use generators. We'll see you then. All right, day 28. We are, yeah, we are cracking straight on. Um, today, we're going to have to, we need a how to, how to use generators. Um, may, maybe we, do we take this gun out? <laughs> uh, no, no, no. We're going we're gonna to search around the uh, local area for bookcases and things like that, and hopefully we'll find one. I mean, we got some residential here. They're going to be busy, but we do need it. So we're going to have to go in. Doesn't look like any of these have got bookshelves, actually. So let's get the hell out of here. Hmm. So we found the uh, the checkpoint to get over the bridge. Um, doesn't look like we're going to be able to get in there. We're going to need a sledge, but we do have one. I don't really want to go over there just yet. Hmm, another little checkpoint area here. There's some military camp there. That's pretty cool. No use to us, though. We got guns. We need a bloody generator. How to use generators. All right, so we are back at base. Uh, no look with the generator, of course. Oh, water's looking a little bit... Uh... Oh, well, that's, that's not good, is it? Uh, I think we need to build some more around. I think you can connect multiple. That is not good. That's all. It's only just been bloody raining, though. We're going to have to come up here to uh, to wash ourselves, I think. But, uh, yeah, we'll just kick around on the roof for the rest of the day, I think. 
All right, bedtime. 10 to 11, and we're off to sleep. And tomorrow, yeah, we're going to get another rain collector going. All right, day 29. We got a, a fair bit to do. Yeah, we're going to get a uh, crack on with that rain collector. We're going to need some wood. I don't know if we've got enough garbage rags. Well, there's one right there. Uh, we could probably dismantle this door as well. Uh, we ain't getting no bloody wood, though, are we? Oh, leveling carpentry. I'll take that. Not the burnt bacon. Hmm. Can't see the plumbing in, so what we're going to do is we're going to move that rain collector to our sink in the bathroom, I think. If we can pick it up without it breaking. If we place it there, should be able to plumb that in, I think. Yeah, we can. Okay, that's good. So we got two now, so that that's that's good. That's good. Oh, wow, we are low on a... Well, we don't have any propane. That's not good. Okay, well, that's another mission for us. We need industrial. We need propane tanks. So maybe, maybe we head up there today and have a little look up there possibly i did want to uh, do some dismantling of car wrecks but uh guess not mm, nothing in there <laughs> pretty much a, uh, a waste of time going in there um yeah no propane just cement maybe an old easy pickings tools oh another machete <sighs> industrial propane tank okay it is heavy but we need that okay we got it let's get the hell out of here we'll also keep an eye out for propane uh, trucks because they will obviously have a lot of propane in them is it full yeah oh yeah it's full nice 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 okay all right and that's the end of the day we're gonna hit the hay and then tomorrow well who knows what tomorrow is gonna bring we'll see you in the morning all right day 30 wow we are we are powering through we are getting there now i've had a little look at the online map and there's a school here and a school here so that is our mission today it's going to be down down this road it's uh it's going to be something i think so yeah we're going to eat some butter because we were low on weight um which isn't good we're on 76 so let's get them calories pumping there we go uh, yeah, we got some food on it. We got a propane tank. Uh, yeah, we should be fine. We may we'll be able to dismantle some cars if we need to. It's going to be an adventure. This one, it's uh, it's going to be an adventure. So we'll see how we uh, how we uh, get on. I think a lot of zombies around. A lot of zombies. We're going to have to uh, we're going to have to play this smart. I think. God damn, there's a lot of them, and the road is pretty congested. Oh, there's a gun store here. Hmm. Interesting. All right, we got a little uh, little runner to get us down here. Let's go and see how bad. Oh yeah, the congestion is quite bad. We're gonna have to get a little relay going with the cars. I think we'll clear this out a bit, but we're gonna use this to go up this street and the Humvee to go along the North Street there. <laughs> A lot of zeds, a lot of zeds. Oh, we got a police station there as well. That's uh, quite interesting. We're about halfway down. Um, so we, we are making progress. It's going to be l slow progress, but progress nonetheless. All right, so we are getting tired. We're going to head back, I think. Um... Yeah, we got about halfway, so we can bring all the propane torches, all three of them down with us, all filled up. Um, and yeah, we, we, can, we can push down, I think, definitely. We will get down there, 100%. We got a little relay system going. <laughs> all right, and there we go. The end of day 30. It's 11 o'clock. We've got progress. We've got a clear mission on where we need to go, and I think we will we can do it. Um, but yeah, we're going to leave it there for this episode. As always, thank you so much for watching. Uh, it really does mean a lot, and I uh, hope you're enjoying it, and I'll see you in the next one. Cheers!